All right, so Tony Khan is out here signing deals. I don't talk about these TV deals because I don't know what the fuck there is to talk about. But for whatever reason, everybody's obsessed with this Warner Brothers Discovery TV rights deal. And if Tony Khan's going to get it, he's been working on this deal for what seems like forever. So let's get into it. AEW Shockwaves is coming to Fox. Is it coming to Fox 5? Is it coming to your local Fox show? No, it's coming to Fox Sports 1. AEW may have reached an agreement with Warner Brothers Discovery while also seeking a new television partner. After months of no negotiations, a television deal between AEW and Warner Bros. Discovery is to be finalized as the current deal expires at the end of this year. There are talks about AEW negotiating with Fox to air a one-hour show called Shockwave for which they already filed a trademark. The show could be broadcast on Fox Sports 1. On the latest edition of Dry Mouth and Cotton Mouth Wrestling Observer Radio, Dave Meltzer reported AEW still discussing airing one-hour shows on Fox Sports 1 with Fox. Meltzer said... <clears throat> The Fox deal is done. Okay, I don't know how to do it. The Fox deal is not done. I know a lot of people have been talking about the idea on the Fox network. I do not know, but I would strongly I would strongly suspect it will not be on the Fox network. It will probably be on another station. Okay, wait a minute. Let me read this because I don't know what the... Oh, he's speculating just obvious shit, and it drives me crazy. Listen to what this man said. The Fox deal is not done. I know a lot of people have been talking about the deal on the Fox network. I do not know, but I would very strongly suspect it will not be on the Fox network. It will probably be on another station. You know, whether if SF, FS1, which is a different station... Whether it's a streaming component, I don't know. And it's not, and I don't believe it's a done deal either. I think it's something that they're working on. Although, as far as the Shockwave thing, they did trademark the name of Shockwave. So they have to be pretty darn close to a deal to go and actually go to the length of trademarking the name. This man literally just speculated a bunch of bullshit. And I'm reporting it because... I don't even want to say reporting. And I'm talking about it because it's, this is a hot topic. Since the, the launch of AEW Dynamite October 2019, AEW programming has been featured on Warner Brothers Discovery channels. Tony Khan has consistently emphasized the significance of bringing wrestling back to TBS and TNT following the conclusion of WCW in 2001. So let's just go ahead and talk about it. Taking Dave Meltzer out of the equation because I really wish I didn't read that. Does AEW need another TV show? The answer is no. Unless, if Shockwave is just like a news update, reality type, back scenes, backstage preview type show, I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. Because WWE used to do that back in the day. They used to have like a, a Entertainment Tonight type show. I forgot the name of it because I used to watch it all the time on Saturdays. You would just get like updates on TV uh, that you may have missed, um, storylines that you may have missed. They'll like show you um, feature a superstar and a little bit of taste of their life. They'll show you some back scenes action, behind the stage shenanigans, stuff like that. And you got your advertisements. If that's what Shockwave is going to be... I'm all for it because they do need help with their online stuff. Now, if Shockwave is going to be another AEW Dynamite, Rampage, or Collision, absolutely not. They don't know what to do with the TV they got. No one watches Rampage. No one watches Collision except the sickos. AEW Dynamite, people don't even watch it. It's just now AEW is becoming the pay-per-view. People would rather pay 50 bucks. To watch a pay-per-view than watch the TV on a regular basis. So, this is why I'm going to leave it off with. Would you watch AEW Shockwave if it was like a news a la, think of it like Entertainment Tonight, Access Hollywood kind of thing, but for wrestling? Or would you watch, watch Shockwave if it was just another wrestling show? 
Y'all hit me in the comments and tell me what you think. Let's have the conversation.